And we are back. It's more protagonist Jaywalk. And antagonist Kim. Oh, yeah. So, I just need to find out if I can sell to people. Let's speak up. The Looks like there's a merchant down there. Is cleansed. Nope. See that underneath area? There, I thought there was a human down there. Yeah, maybe I can sell with this guy. Yeah, there it is. Blurg. Yeah, someone's showing off. Ripplebark could sustain an entire village if seen. Oh, nice little Just because of the I didn't let people reset their stuff. Ah, a visitor. You're a welcome sight. But let us observe the customs of the locals. The scholar's brow tenses. His voice spills into your skull, the spores connecting mind to mind. Blurg, proud member of the Society of Brilliance, at your service. Or perhaps not. Your mind is far more complex than that of the fungi. Well, I've never heard of you. Understandable. We are small in number and rarely stay in one place for long. My colleagues and I are working to improve conditions in the Underdark. This need not be such a dire, hostile place. It's curious to find a surface dweller here. What has brought you down so deep? Uh, well, actually, you might know. Truly remarkable. But why come to the Underdark, where they hold so much power? Uh, yeah, let's just tell them. You were infected by an illithid tadpole. It's a miracle you're still intact. You must be worried sick, but have no fear. I have a friend who may be able to assist. Omelium! I hope this is important, Blurg. My Zerkwood samples need constant attention. It is. This adventurer has an illithid tadpole inside his head, but he hasn't turned. No ceramorphosis? Uh -oh. That's impossible, but intriguing. Are you looking to have it extracted? Yes. Geich, your head will make a fine trophy for my queen. Please hold. I understand your rage against my kin. One of my brethren forced a tadpole into your eye. Or ear, perhaps? But I assure you, I stand with the Society of Brilliance, not the colonies of my people. Oh uh, yeah, Warlock, man. I've, I've made a lot of strange allies for information. Let's hear it. Fool! They infest your head and invade your dreams, and still you would parley. I ask only that you refrain from violence. I respect that your opinion of my kind may be... charged. If that settles matters for the time being, would you like a diagnosis? Open your mind to me. Let us see what lurks within. Yeah, do it. As the Meloon's mind pierces yours, the tadpole pulses with power. It feels ten times its size. Alive, awake, almost smug. This is most unusual. The incubation period should be complete, as should your transformation. But the lava is infused with strange magic. It appears to be in some form of stasis. Uh, what happens if the stasis goes away? I can only theorize, but I suspect your transformation would be. Well, you already knew that answer. You should ask me. Agonizing and instantaneous. I thought it was always agonizing, Amelium. Well, yes, but that wasn't my point. Oh, out. shit. Can you extract it? No, 
It appears to be shielded from physical and magical influence. And even without the shield, the extraction would involve severe cranial trauma. Oh my gosh. That doesn't sound ideal. It is not ideal. The process would but not to worry. Oops. Should you transform, I will happily perform a new examination. Uh, let's tell him about the ship. See if he can help me anything else. A nautiloid? Fascinating. I have never set foot on one myself. They were our warships during the greatest eras of the Illithid Empire. We ruled the entire astral plane from their decks. The design was lost when the Gith rebelled and ended our dominion. Thanks for all the information. Of course. I am sorry I cannot assist you in its removal. But I have an idea. Oh. Perhaps I should start taking notes. There may be a way to bypass that stasis. There are many alchemical substances that can influence the mind. So here's my thought process. I'm okay with this parasite if I can be Venom, right? Like if I can work with it and maybe I got to feed it something or some shit, then I'm awesome for that. Because it's like, okay, cool. If we can both live and we can work together and be awesome together, I'm on point. But right now it's currently, well, if this thing breaks loose, I'm dead. Well, yeah, right? so you're, I think you're screwed either way, regardless of whether you think it'll help you or not. You still want it out of your head. I think if... And you, and you want, like, your original power and memories back, right? Because remember, the initial, like... No, I still have my memories. I just lost my power. But well, that's fine. Well, no, I know. That's what I'm saying. But you don't want to be stuck with the worm and not have your original power. You could be level 50 or 100 before you well, have no, to live Well, no. The it. limits... I no, no. You know what? I'm, I'm just exasperating the example. Like, yeah. What I mean is, like, you know, Lazel and all of them are significantly more powerful than they are now, but the tadpole is literally reverting them back to the beginning and their well, memories I think it are is. done. I think it absorbed all their power. And no, you start otherwise from... they'd have it. That, that this is literally what, what, what Will and Gale were talking about. Well, regardless, here's my thought process. I want one of two solutions. The ideal solution is that we can work together and this parasite is now a symbiote to me and we're one and the same. Mm -hmm. That's an ideal solution. The second option is I remove this bastard from my head and he dies. I want one of those two, preferably the first. What I don't want to happen is for me to get killed. So any solution that involves me surviving is a win. And if he can survive to the parasite, I'm okay with that. Like, at the end of the day, it's like a Venom situation. I'm like, mm, you know, maybe it's not ideal because I have to go through some extra steps to keep him alive too. But I'd rather that be the answer. That's true. Hey, hey, hold on. Three things. One, I'm really upset you didn't get my fungi joke last episode. All right? Real sad about that. Two, look at the tentacles moving. <laughs> and three, I'd pick number two. Uh, isn't the stasis why it hasn't killed me? I do not intend to shatter its protection. I need only bypass the interference that prevents me from communicating with the lava. What do we what, bypass? What do we need? A tincture distilled from a collection of rare mushrooms. They have subtle psionic influence i would require a fresh tongue of madness and timusk spores but be warned in their natural state both of these mushrooms can be quite dangerous timusks cause confusion in those that approach them the tongue is self-explanatory Uh, so where do I find that? The Underdark, of course, although they are quite rare, and their discovery perilous. Hmm. I imagine Lenore would have them in her possession. She served Mistra as a cleric. Uh, yeah, where does she live? 
the southwest when I last saw her, although her tower does have a tendency to move. Why would a, that's, that is strange. Why would a cleric have a bunch of dangerous mushrooms for her? Because they're healers, she right? She is quite fond of her garden. Lenore has always been a lonely sort. Uh, nature was her only companion. I offered her the chance to join the society, but she refused. Her experiments on Sousa Bark took priority. Okay, I'll come back when I find the mushrooms. May your travels be safe and swift. Now, we'll talk to what's his name. He might sell you stuff. Oh. Welcome back. Have you made any new discoveries? Uh, can we trade? I do enjoy a good bargain. If anything in my private collection is to your liking. Oh yeah, do it to get rid of stuff. Yeah, I'll give you all like, my yes, scroll. You like you have five different scrolls of things, like get rid of all those, right? Uh now I think I can do How do I get rid up of top. my uh up top? Would you want to trade or barter? Which one? If I go to trade, sellwares. Yep, got rid of all that shit. Then I go back to barter. Uh, let's see what he has of actual interest to me. Nope. Well, that's interesting. Uh, that's kind of cool. You have a lot of cash, so you could buy those revi revivify in case you think you might need them. You could buy the food from them because you need food for the camp. I've gotten so much of that, though. Well, so let's see what we got going. Uh, Genial Strider. Okay, unimpeded by difficult terrain. That's not bad. Scorching Ray. Okay. The Baneful. This blade's magical powers only function if it is bound to an Eldritch Knight or is a Warlock's pack weapon. This weapon has a plus one bonus damage attack rolls. Okay, well, none of that matters for me. Uh, okay, Scroll of Lightning Bolt. That's interesting. Scroll of Conjure Minor and Elemental. Yeah, let's do it. You already have Lightning. Why would you pick that? I don't have Scroll of Lightning Bolt. No, I mean, you already just have Lightning naturally as your power. Why would you pick that? You never know when a situational use comes up. Okay. What else? Uh, what are the other boots there? Also like this. What's this? Uh, Griff Ward and Ground. Nope. Oh, Magic Missile. You already have that. That's pretty interesting. Uh, what's this? Now this you could use because you need a better staff. Uh, what is this? Melf's Acid Arrow? You gain a plus one bonus to a spell save DC and a spell attack roll. You get a weapon enchantment plus one and you get Mel's Acid Arrow versus the other one which only gives you topple but it does give you lightning charges. Electric Veins, when the Wilder deals damage with a spell or cantrip, they gain two lightning charges, main hand only. Yeah, but this one seems like it'd be more worth it. Try it. I mean, worse than you worse when you find them, you can resell it back. Uh, to them. Life Charger. When the wearer gains lightning charges, they also gain three temporary hit points. Now, did you give Shadowheart that lightning one? Wait, lightning charges? So you could use that with the water effect for what's-her-name if you want. But... Wait, doesn't this give me lightning charges, though? The, the, the weapon you currently have, yes. So you could wear that yourself. They get two lightning charges. Main hit only. Do it. Um, fuck. No, 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 no. Uh -huh. Buy it. Buy the circlet. Because like I said, it's cheap. You have a bunch of money to buy stuff with. Oh, and I don't even gonna, have anything on, but... And you're going to sell a bunch more stuff and yep. put that circlet on you, right? Let's see. And that uh, ring. Scorching ray. We talked about this. Uh, Troll of the Dead. Oh, this is interesting. This is kind of cool. Sunwalker's Gift. The wearer can see in the dark up to 12 feet. Okay, that's interesting, but... 
cinders. Whenever you burn an enemy, you gain two turns of heat. What does that mean? Engulfed by vengeful fire takes one to four each turn, but can use heat convergence. So you would take damage. Mm, yeah. But you could use heat convergence. We don't know what that is. And do we? I don't know. That doesn't seem as whatever with that. It's interesting. Um, and then you have a bunch of different scrolls. I would sell those. And maybe another few random items that you have. You know no, I kind of like everything I have. Um, but I mean, you have multiples of the other ones. Do you care? This is only 1 to 12, which bolt. Yeah. This isn't this this witch bolt is definitely not worth it. Uh nothing. I already have the scorching ray. This doesn't matter to me. This is cool, but Do you have bottles of grease already? Yeah. You could get rid of those then. Unless you feel like you want them all the time. No, and the protection gets you the needle. Hmm. I'll keep it for now. Like that, you're not gonna need that. And the linen, that leather helmet you said you wanted to sell. That longbow, no one cares. Same thing with the dagger. Oh, uh, let's see. The quill, all that other stuff. Only worth 53, that's hilarious. Uh, like what are those? Those are like the two matching items. What are these? Uh, it's a wyvern toxin. Mm -hmm. Put your weapon. I gotta give that to what's your face. Yeah, well, I don't yeah. want to give up any of that. So, I um, would say... You have to use cash the rest of the way, but that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. You have plenty of money. And then take those and try all those on. Go for it. Yeah, I just worry. Let's find out. Try it. Like I said, the worst thing you can do is just resell it back to him at some point. Yeah. And then if I go to her... Um, go to everybody. They all have something that they could sell him. Like all that extra armor right. and things. Sell all that to him. Just go into trade, not barter. Unless you want to buy something else from him. This is like our original circuit. But yeah, I guess we don't need all this. Oh, I switched it out anyway. Well, it's her original. I'll keep her original. Oh, here. I didn't care about this. Yep, Baruni. Alright. Yeah. And then... You have to take the money back to... Okay. Well, well you have to do that. it later. But that's fine. Yep, she there. has her own stuff. Now her, she has a bunch of random things. Yeah, but these are better off. Like, well, you can, well these. We yeah, get rid yeah of. I meant the normie stuff. The other stuff you can give to uh, Gail. This is like her original you stuff. You keep that. Oh, those are her boots. Yeah, those are special boots. Okay, then that's it. Sell that. Oh wait, no, harder. All right, and then you go. Very well. I have mushrooms to catalog. All right, and then equip that stuff you just got on yourself. Um, have, here's the question. What's her name? Give you the money too, by the way. Let's do this. Uh, latest. So that's cool. Um, I think this is, actually this can just be sold. This doesn't have a spell on it. But is that, are you Welcome sure? Because that's what Carlac had Have originally, you right? New discoveries? You wouldn't want to give her that back, or? I do enjoy a good bargain. Well, no, it's useless. I can sell it. Is to your liking. All right, cool. Very well. All right, now if I go back to her. Well, Carlac has your money. Uh, send to me. What's the story? Oh, you just sent money to camp. Yeah, I fucked up. Oh well, I'll deal with it. I'll remind me later. Um, you don't need anything else in hers. Go put on all your stuff that you just bought. I crave blood. Wait, I bought stuff. What so did I get? can you put the circlet and then equip the new staff? Right. Hold on. Literally to the left of the scrolls. The staff and the circlet. You were going to put the circlet on yourself, weren't you? Life charger. Lightning charges. That's what I wanted to find out. Can't afford to stay idle. Does she get... She has the boots. 
When the wearer dashes or takes a similar action during combat, they gain three lightning charges. Okay. So Does she gain lightning charges though? She does, just by wearing the item. Yes. And that one I would unequip it and just, I don't know, give it to yourself, I guess. No one back home will ever believe this. This right here, I'm gonna send to her because this will become OP. Uh but Wait, if I go if that's back just there, a ring, give that to someone when you give Well that's gonna be consumed. Uh this will go to Shadowheart. I think and then you try out that one. Still keep the spell sparker, but try the new one and see if you like it or not. This is a quarter staff. But I wonder. Let me send it to Shadowheart real quick. She can't use it. Can Shadowheart use this? She can, but is it two handed? No, it's versatile. Okay, so keep it for her lightning thing. Is that what you're thinking? Yeah, she doesn't say she says she's pro it's proficient. Right? Proficiency, okay. martial weapons, that includes Alright, so then uh, you're gonna put the other circlet on her, right? Quarter staffs. So then if you put this on her whenever so when she you deals damage with a cantrip or a spell, she gains two lightning charges. And then when she gains lightning charges she gains three temporary hit points. Okay. That's like an OP med matchup for her. And do you want to sell that? Send to send. No, that one I can have him consume. But then what's going to happen is, once we get a ring, once we find a way to make her immune to uh, stuff, uh -huh. dude, we can deck her out. Okay. This, um, go this back to yourself and now. give yourself the new staff that you just bought, right? Oh, yeah, because I don't have a staff anymore. This is legit. It's cool. Boom. And what does this do? Holy shit. Shoot a green arrow. Is this like a spell level two evocation spell? Now, if I use this, does this just mean I can do different spells or does this use up a spell slot? I don't think it uses up. It's like the other ones. Isn't that that right corner of your hot bar down there? Do you see it? Uh, hold so, on. So in your hot bar down there with your spells and things? I it's right it's, here. Yeah. So I think it's... So if I can use it on a long rest, so maybe it doesn't hit up my spell slot. But I mean, it's still cool. Use it, dude. It's sexy as hell. Well, perhaps after I finish my research here, I'll join. Okay, okay. So. All right. Well, that's it. You cleared out can I go? your stuff, which is good. Well, he said I could go somewhere. Um, it's over. It's down there. This way. Yep. It's up there, past that glowy in the darky mushroom. I need a quick word. Oh, that's so. Walker, tongue talker. Far you've come. Reach into memory. Tell me of home. Oh, let's see. Yeah, fill my heart with memories of my most treasured places. It reveals its own home in reply. A humid cove filled with decaying myconid corpses. Dwega destroyed my people. I am a sovereign with no circle. This circle does not welcome me. But I have heard the song. You mean to cleanse the Dwergar rot. I mean to join you. Oh yeah, you can join me. Remain in the Underdark, and I will follow we cleanse the rot together 
Dude, this is badass. Holy shit. Um, wait, are you going backwards? Oh, no, no, yeah, beyond the, uh, there. Dude, this is sexy as hell. Oh, there's another person right there. Dude, what is that? I don't know, but go talk to other Oh, it's person. a spore servant. You could talk to it, though. It looks like an old man with a beard, but talk to the, the person right there. Uh, let's talk to uh, you. Seems the shrooms are letting in more people every day. You see a fella on his own on your way in. Dwarf. Balin's his name. Can you describe him? Bald. Blue tunic. Dumb as a stick. Uh, I have not seen him. Right. Never mind. Show me your wares. Oh, sh dude. Hold. Oh, my God. That, for her, would be good. Yeah, mass healing word, healing word. I mean, she already has the healing ward spell, but she doesn't have the mass one. That armor is Rare nice. heavy armor, okay. Superior material, you take one less slashing damage. Body aid, gain plus one bonus to strength saving throws and checks. Dude, holy snaps. I mean, you could buy that outright. How much is Rare, it? Rare, medium. Oh my gosh. Hide armor plus two. Ooh, that looks sexy as hell. Uh, medium. Oh my gosh. Padded armor, rare light armor. Because what am I wearing? I'm light armor. So you could wear that because you need light armor, don't you? Uh. What about the one to the right? Yeah, it's definitely a lot freaking better. Okay, but you're not proficient in that. Oh, I'm not. You need, you need light only. So what is that one? Oh, light armor. So. But with that top one though. Well, hold on. Was this no, heavy? No, no. Medium, light. No. Oh no, that's no, medium. No, no. The next one is light. Light. That's technically better than what you've got. Yeah, but one more AC for the cost. I don't know if I care that much. That flail's uh, cool. Jump. What about the gloves or the bracers? You don't have any of that stuff, do you? Holy shit, dude. Your... Your weapon attack also deals two acid damage? I would do that. Your thing is already acid, isn't it? Yeah, go for it. Well, hold on. Hers isn't. Dude. Oh my god. And it's only 76? Yes! A thousand times, yes. Um, real quick, what are those bracers to the left? Anything? Oh, let's see. Uh, Hail of Thorns. What does that do? You don't have that. That's cool. Uh, the thorns deal weapon damage to the target and then explode. The explosion deals additional 1 to 10 piercing damage. That's actually pretty cool. That is interesting. In the next one, there's another set there. Uh, cleansing touch. Oh, nah. Um, but the other thing I was gonna ask, besides the bracers, what about the crossbows? Because Lazel uses a crossbow. Are there any better ones than what she has? It's just plus one. Okay. Holy shit. This is wild. That's interesting. This is potion of invisibility. Uh, what was that other ring? Honestly, the heavy armor plus two. Okay, well, first of all, let me... Yeah, do that. For the 76 is fine. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, the other stuff is kind of... Well, let good. me go to... She can do heavy now. See? She wears medium. I know, but she's proficient in heavy now that you changed her class around. When before she couldn't wear heavy. You know what I mean? 
Although, what's that furthest one? One was a light armor, wasn't it? What are the other ones compared to hers? Next one over. This would be less. This would be Okay, more. down one. What was that last one before you do the ringlet armor? This is just like... No, no. The other one? This Up one? top? To the left? This? Yeah. That's light armor. Oh, okay. Uh... Disadvantage on stealth checks? I guess it doesn't really matter. She's not really stealthy, but... This is the same. That's this will nice. give you 17... Why, why does this give you less? 16. Well, the other one doesn't have anything special with it, does it? Plus 2. 12. 17. Why is this given 17? Because one's a chainmail plus 2. That's chainmail plus 1. Chainmail plus 1. And this one doesn't have as good of a like a, a disadvantage thing. That one gives you better... Ringmail. Bodily aid, it gives you superior material, and it has disadvantage on stealth checks. The other one, it's only a plus one, and it doesn't give you anything special. Uh, what about her? Uh, this will actually tell us our answer. Uh, she currently has his bow. Do that one. That gives her a hamstring and the other one, right? I just mean they hit harder than what she already has, so if you ever need to do a distance thing with her. Yeah, that's fair. And then next one over. One of those was a good one. Go over. Oh, that's going to be worth it for her, but let's... Uh, wait, wait, wait. Did you want to see who would be better with that, uh, that, that, that chain mail? Real quick. I'm gonna go poor. You're fine, you have and plenty of money. Go to Parlac. Because what is she current? Oh, wait, no, I like this. Yeah, but if it gives her significantly better, what what, what is that compared to what she has on? Sh oh, she's not, she's not proficient in it. I thought she was yeah. heavy. That's fine. I like this because it, uh, it gives you one extra wrath, which gives you more damage. And her. I guess if I were to give her something well, like this. Well, that one gives her a, a bonus to her dexterity and saving throws, though. And her AC goes up plus two. But didn't she get to this right here? If you're not wearing. She's not wearing an armor, which is oh, why I she gets the plus saying. two. Okay. Oh, well, dude, fine. because it doesn't count as wearing armor. I need to give her the perk that gives her plus two if you're unarmored. Dude, that is sexy as hell. Okay, so, are you going to do that heavy for uh, Lazel or for... Uh, I don't think it makes sense for her, does it? No, I meant for Shadowheart. Shadowheart can wear it too. Uh, uh, she's got medium armor 15. This... This chainmail plus why does this I don't that's the part that throws me off is this clearly gives her more. Oh, maybe it's because of the this is higher, mean? but they're, bo know. they're both well the other one has additional stuff with it. That one does not. So when you go up to the blue one in the descript no over one, in the descriptor you get much, much better like abilities with it. The other one it gives you a higher AC, but you don't get any of the stuff the, the saving throws checks and stuff like that. You just take one less slashing damage. That's it. That one gives you more perks with it. Well, this one you still take one less damage, but... If I were you, I'd do the heavy, but... The 17. Yeah. Because then she would go up. That's uncommon heavy armor, and she would go up to fucking... I think she'd go up one because she gets what's her dexterity I don't know you know what let's just fucking try it let's try it what's the worst that can happen I have regrets I don't believe in regrets uh, let's give her this thing, though. I don't want this. Or the feather or the linen. 
It's Cannon's handkerchief. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah, never mind. That's why I kept it. I should honestly send this to fucking camp. So I nicely sell this shit. Ooh. I forgot about this. Even it out. Let's buy it. All right. Bye. Exit out of there. Uh, who is he to you? My useless husband. Sent him for an errand. It's no surprise he's made a mess of it. Use some help find him? Knock yourself out. But don't come begging for coin if you find him. You try to ransom him to me, you'll find yourself skint and stuck with a fat old lout. <laughs> Jesus. Alright, and you're gonna equip that thing, right? Go invisible, my friend. This is cool. He's like. Oh my gosh. No, so. Let's do some uh, gift giving. So. That goes to. Shadowheart. Lazel. This goes to Lazel. That this goes to Lazel. Well, no, no, that was one you were going to wear, were you not? No, because Lazel does more melee damage. Because look. Oh. Uh, no acid. You're going to. When do... your weapon attacks. Yeah, but. But I'm using Eldritch Blast. No, you're not. Your staff has a literal magic that's acid. That's why I thought you bought it. It is a spell, but I don't think that. It's, spell doesn't count as a weapon, a physical weapon attack. The I spell thought, attacks. I thought, I thought it did it. That's why attacks. you bought it. And it was. Con well, regard. No, I Dude, bought it because Lazel it attacks camp. like six times. Okay, don't send it to camp. Oh, no, I'm not doing that. I just I stopped. Lazel just fucking destroys with this. Um. And that's it. God, look how poor I am now. So I go Shadowheart. Now, let's find out if I regret my decisions. And she is the same. No, she went up. She went from 17 to 19. She's still 19. Okay, well, does she get a better perk for having that on? Son of a bunch. Uh, we'll send this to send. Right. Told you should have done the mail plus two. I should have saved. Should have saved. Action, not reaction. Give her that for sure. Cool. Boom. And then give her the ring, right? Oh, she's not proficient with it. What do you mean? She's been sh what has she been shooting with this whole time then? A, a regular. Gosh darn it. I screwed up twice. Eagle oh my Eagle. gosh. It's fine. So send that to yourself to resell it back. Give her the ring. Alright, so she's good. Making me sweat. You had nothing to give to her. Double check. Okay, cool. Well, all right, so I need to fix her situation. What's next? She's good to go. Okay, so go back to you. Go back to the merchant. There was a better bow that you could sell her. So sell those top three things back. Well? Show me your wares, woman. So yeah, right, I totally so right there. that so, so Hold on. Before you do anything, right there. There's a, a bow right there. And then sell back the other thing. What does this do? That one you're supposed to give to what's her name? What the heck? You're gonna give that to uh, Shadowheart with her old lightning thing going on. But, but let's continue what's at hand. I already gave her something, see? Not the necklace. You're supposed to give her the necklace too. That's what we talked about. What the F? That's a ne Whoa. Okay, so hold on. One thing at a time. So Thanks. you're gonna sell the crossbow and the armor back. Correct? Yeah, I'm going to sell this. I don't care about this. Even though I could, you know. Well, wait. You want to keep that, though, in case you don't like the weapon you have, correct? Hold on. Crossbow. I'm it was that, it was that one. For a fraction okay, of the cost. And, and then get a better bow for her. I'd get rid of this. Okay. And I wanted a better bow. You can give that to Lazel because she's proficient in that. And then... Did you want to do the male plus two? So she's better off with medium armor, which was the medium plus two. 
Well, let's... Yeah, just do that. Complete that first. Oh, wow, she's giving me money. Yeah, because that's how that works. So let me go to her. This will be smarter. Medium plus two. Now, here's the question I have. So let's let's exit out, leave, and do latest. Give that. Forgot to sell this. It's fine. Give that to uh, Lazel so she has her crossbow back. Yep. Go back to Lazel. Or bow. I'm sorry. There. Yeah. Perfect. Good. And then. Um. Give her that necklace you were gonna give her. Go back to yourself. Uh, no Send to that me. to Shadowheart. Hmm. Well, equip I mean, equip on Shadow. What does she have here? Aid. I don't even you know what. I would keep That's the, crazy. I would keep that she, she's like, she is going to be my thunder goddess. Like, Pretty holy much. shit. Okay. This is like wild. Um, And then I would keep uh, her necklace for what's his name to consume. Yeah, that's what I was going to do. I have a lot on my mind. So now what I'm going to do is have F5. Eat it. And then. What's up for discussion? Well, I'm gonna buy the medium plus two. Well, oh, oh, you're gonna sell that crossbow, weren't you? That bow down there. Uh, oh, yeah. Just barter. Just there. That's it. Now, <laughs> if I go, I send that to Shadowheart. Because she loses the dexterity bonus. So now she's 19. She's still 19. Yeah. Although, actually, which one do you think looks nicer on her? This? Or this? This? I don't know, what do you think? If this had blue jewels, it'd probably be a better fit. With her amulet? But, I mean, what she's wearing now doesn't really match her diadem thing any better well, well actually look at the difference so, so this shirt gives you plus one to that one less slashing damage okay but it also gives you gain bonus to dexterity and saving throw so put her in that and then give the get yankee half plate back to lazel because it's hers well you can just sell that it's not really like that's special. her original clothing weren't yeah. you gonna try to keep everyone's original stuff yeah i'll send it to camp then yeah, I think even though it shows more less skin, I think this just looks better on her. I think sometimes showing less skin is better. Okay. Well, let's not make... We already made a whole other episode of you just bartering. Just, yeah, because I'm so special. Okay, F5. Let's leave at least. Let's see this new little section. Oh, wait. Here's the section. I gotta go here. Holy smokes. Uh... What is happening here? Bush cap. Pale corpse. Money. Icy metal. Cool. Take all that. It's all stone. Wood bark. Okay. Garlic. Garlic. Reed. The cover proudly announces this book to be Flumph Mating Rituals. It's not, though. Uh, investigation, baby. Bliss spores. I told you that. Those, the fun guys gave you cool powers. The scrutiny proves too much. The lurid text melts away before your eyes. An illusion. What remains are simple instructions written in a spare hand. The secret to forging adamantine. You're keeping that. Dude, I'm giving it to that one guy. The guy that you killed? No. Or a proper mom. No, no, no. Just keep that for yourself for now. The adamantine forge. The yeah. Same the wizard do was hunting for, it seems. Dude, that is gangster. Alright. 
Scroll of blindness, backpack, ray backpack. of sickness. Pick up all of it. Uh, Shadow Heart. Shadow Heart. Camp. Uh, mushrooms. Mushrooms. Scroll of blindness. Scroll ray of sickness. Shadow. What is this? Oh, shit. That was cool. Uh, become invisible two turns. Invisibility ends earlier if you attack. Okay, so this is kind of cool, actually. That's for Asterion, but pick it up. Yeah, take it. I'll pick it up. It's pretty legit. What else? Do your highlight thing? There's something else there, wasn't it? Nope. Oh, okay, that's it. That is super cool. You got a bunch of goodies. Awesome. All right. Well, now we got some goodies. It was worth it, guys. It wasn't just an episode of me screwing around with my wares. Maybe I can talk to this guy. Can you pet it? Oh. <laughs> it didn't tell me anything. Alright, well this is your boy, Protagonist Jaywa. An antagonist, Kim. Alright, bye for now, guys. Bye.